Hey, what's up everybody? Today I got a quick video to show you how to make complex shapes in Modeler. You have the shape and you want to make a complex cut or cut out out of it. What you do is you just make a new layer. I'll change the color just so you can see better. And basically you draw on your shape the mask of where you would want it to be, right? Just like in ZBrush. But instead of drawing it with on just the surface, it's like with uh, with a mesh, right? And we're only worried about the intersection in between the two shapes, not really the surface of the the shape itself. So you know, you can take your time and make sure it's clean and stuff, but it's no big deal. So you grab your your layer, then you can even like you know bend um, the the cut around the shape right so you have something that wraps around and you can get really you know, detailed with these um, these cutouts right just grab all of this go boolean right here split select the shape you want to split and then apply there you go you got your fancy cut in your shape so after that, you know, you can clean it up if you want and, uh, you know, attach it or raise it, you know, make it smaller, make it bigger. And then you got a fun, uh, a fun shape in there, right? It's two different surfaces, two different meshes, you know. Is the... The problem with this tool, the split tool, it's pretty cool, but you know, you can't draw the shape or like control it as uh, well as this. So if you just need like a simple cut or, you know, a simple uh, intersection, um, it's still very useful. But if you want to get more technical or fancy with your cuts, uh, that's how I would do it, right? So all of this is different, uh, different parts. Right. And it also works with uh, organic stuff or characters. So let's say I grab this guy and I duplicate his, his whole torso and I just merge everything together. I'll smooth it out just a little bit so that it's not as you know, sharp as this. There we go. Um, make a new layer. We'll put the different material again. And then just draw the you know shape of what you want. Right? So well, it's a armor plate or something. I think I'm making sci-fi shapes, but it will work just as well if you draw. You know, or medieval style shapes, but grab this, split, and then you got your two different parts. And then, yeah, you can just get rid of this one if you want and put it back. You could do it on the character itself if you want to, just to show you. Um, it's easier if I you know, pull it away, but then you can you know, place it exactly where you want. So that's like a, uh, a skin or a thickness over the character. And then, you know, you can start uh, editing that mesh, making new straps or whatever, attach stuff. You can also split that shape again if you want. Make another panel, maybe right here. This split, boom. character like that if you want 
and yeah use it in uh, in addition to the normal split too right? if you don't need a crazy cut that's just faster than to click all the buttons for the booleans right? We can even do it with the, the hands and the arms too, like nothing's stopping you. Uh, draw, grab this. And draw a glove, maybe. The resolution's pretty low, but you get the idea, right? Easier to to do like a mech arm, you know, or robot hand. But there's fingers underneath your your glove. looking shape for you guys. 